Where are we? Why are you carrying a basket from our inside our house? <laughs> We're doing a 0.7 kilometer walk to our cabin. It looks like it might have less amenities than our van, so <laughs> should be interesting. So Nellie, tell me all about this new place you're staying at tonight. Is it a log cabin? Are you enjoying it? Wow. So this fan is not plugged into electricity. It's working off the heat of the stove. Do we know what it does? What purpose it serves? What do you mean? It blows the heat around. Oh. Cabin light, baby. So, now that you've had a little bit of time to uh, settle in, how are you enjoying the cabin? Have you found anywhere comfortable to hang out? Are you listening to me? So I just destroyed Evan. Catan, once again, we played the board game version. She's supposed to be a core player. Every, but every number she wanted to roll just came up. <laughs> we, needed, we needed the big board uh, so that it took up space for the photos that we were taking for this hip camp. But this hip camp has a battleship, and Evan swears he can beat me at battleship. Let it be known that I just won battleship round one. Ah, uh, that was the only round. This, okay. This is, another, this is another game of pure <laughs> luck, and of course you won again. The luckiest person. Do you want to play? Uh, ah, it's funny that we put our last ship pretty close to one another. Time to go to that house. Did you happen to make this trip at night? Yeah, big night last night. We all had to pee again. And that is the outhouse experience. Great whistle, huh? Mm -hmm. Coffee or tea, man? Coffee? Let us know in the comments below if you'd like coffee or tea. And you'll have an escape. Straight from the bean. <laughs> I would get like a spoon note instead of that. I don't know. This is just dirty. <laughs> made us some very nice instant coffee this morning. Haven't tasted it yet, <laughs> so we'll see how this goes. It's too hot! <laughs> but after this, we are gonna head out for what is expected to be a beautiful hike up into the Alpine a little bit, and we're gonna see larches for the first time. I'm really excited. to go on a little hike with me up to White Queen. 
It's six and a half miles, 2,000 feet, round trip. Been doing a lot of riding, so our hiking legs could use some work. <laughs> Let's get to it. Ashy hiking legs, bike scarred hiking legs. Okay, we made it to the turn off. What does this say? Oh my goodness, we didn't change the battery on this GoPro. We got 10%. So I'll make this quick. We just got to the intersection of the trail that's gonna lead us up to White Queen, AKA Bird Queen. Um, from here, it's more straight up, about two miles. See you guys there. Sick bars. Nice, way to clean it. Sick climb. Now when you're climbing uphill on very technical terrain, or any terrain, on a bike, you wanna make sure you're close to the handlebars weighted on the front so that you don't flip back because you're already going like this, so you wanna even out your uh, weight distribution. Thus, T-Rex arms. <sighs> yeah, but you also wanna make sure you don't lose traction on the back either. Yes, it's a game of weight distribution. <laughs> These here are larches. Larches turn yellow in the fall, even though they look like regular trees, they turn yellow, which is really cool. We've never seen any, or at least this many in person. I'm really excited about this hike. Towards the bottom, I wasn't seeing any and some leaves still hadn't began turning. So I thought we were gonna be too early for the larches, but it looks like we're here at the perfect time. What's a pirate's favorite letter? R. Not R. It's the C, all these larches. Ta -da. Let's go. I'm probably gonna have to put a laugh track in. We're about a quarter of a mile, actually less than that, 0.1 miles from the end. And the larches are just everywhere. Penelope hasn't stopped running once. There are birds up we, there. <laughs> the trail finally mellowed out, but it was tough going there for a second. And this is an amazing, amazing trail. Holy moly, it feels like a magical yellow fall wonderland. Evan, you were skeptical at the beginning? Yeah, we were bushwhacking a few things at the beginning. I wasn't down for that, but it turned out to be quite nice. And obviously this is our first time with these yellow pine trees, so. Still got some ways to go. So, see you at the top again. nice older couple up here told us all about the travels they've done they lived in a bus before settling down in Nelson and then they had three kids but one very interesting thing I noticed about them is that the guy was drinking his water out of a vodka bottle <laughs> like not a glass one why plastic you, one why are you saying water Mrs. I think Smir it was water because it was mostly oh, it was a Smirnoff it's mostly full we got up here and then it was just under halfway when he was leaving. He wasn't making any faces. We didn't smell any alcohol, but That's maybe it's the only bottle we could find in his car. When you're older, you just say YOLO, you climb up a mountain and then you take a couple swigs at the top and then you head back down with your wife.
People of the internet, we've reached large heaven. Picture number 1,555. This is a video. Oh, peace. And love. Are we large lovers now? One of us is. These are so cool. We just, I don't know why we couldn't bring our bike up here. They're so yellow. To say that I am officially obsessed with larches would be an understatement. <laughs> yeah. Evan will attest to that. He already is very annoyed with me it's... because I want to take a picture there. In there, in there, in there, in there. Here's a couple. It's annoying. We made it. We made it back. The, the dog, despite having Full dinner at the top. Want some more? No surprise. I'm keeping this scoop in half. That hard. Okay. If you want to go check out that abandoned mine, there it is. There's the tracks. You don't like it? Um, I only don't like it because we climbed double the amount. We passed it on accident. I just noticed the rail. Yeah, what do you think I'm standing on? Wow. That's really cool. Cool. I am happy we came up here just to turn around and see that. Cool story.